Let's make a nice healthy breakfast using the instant pot pressure cooker this morning. I'm going to use uh, steel cut oats, about a third of a cup. I'm going to add to a mason jar. I'm using the little chubby jars because I think they're nice to eat out of. So we'll put it with about a third of a cup of steel cut oats. We're going to use the pressure cooker to make them smooth and creamy. Then I'm going to add about a third of a cup of Almond Breeze. This one has a hint of honey in it, uh, but choose the one that you like. Some like uh, sugar-free, some like a little sweetness. This one has a little extra flavor with the honey in. Or you could add honey to this if you'd like to. We're going to use a third of a cup of Almond Breeze or your favorite type of almond milk. And let's take a third of a cup of Greek yogurt. I use vanilla flavor. are all good healthy ingredients good nutrition for you to get energy for your day all right then I'm going to add a tablespoon of black chia seeds I'm using organic black chia seeds and these are also packed with nutrition, fiber, and helps keep you full in a healthy way during the day. All right. Then I'm going to add also about a third of a cup of blueberries just to make a layer of those. And these are also little nutrition bullets. Okay, on top of that, make a little toasty layer of chopped almonds. All right, I just tore three little pieces of foil just to cover these enough to keep water from going into the jar while it's in the instant pot. That's all. And now we'll get the instant pot and add some water to it. All right, I'm going to use the instant pot here with um, the stainless container. And I'm going to add a little um, rack on the bottom just to keep the bottles from rattling as I have this tip from one of my viewers. I'm going to add a, about a cup and a half of water. And then each of these little jars is going to sit in here on the rack. Just like this. Water rack and jars covered with foil. All right, I'm gonna add the lid. Now, um, one feature on this pot that I really like is there's little arrows to show you how to line up the lid real quickly. You don't have to fuss around with how to get the lid on it. So, match up the first arrow, push it, push it to close. Hear the little sound and the second arrow lines up, you're ready to go. Now all we have to do is set it properly. For the steel cut oats, I'm going to use the rice setting. That's 12 minutes. Um, if you're using instant oats, you don't need to cook it that long. All right, we're ready to go. It's going to build up its pressure and we'll be back to have our breakfast when it's cooked for 12 minutes.
as we're getting started I just want to show you you want to make sure that the valve is in the sealing mode and when you're ready to release the pressure you turn it to the venting mode and when this uh, has its pressure build up the little red button will pop up okay the cooking's done and we're gonna let the pressure escape okay pressure has escaped we'll lift off the lid Let's see we have nice steam jars in here All right, let's pick them out and see how they look. Look at that oatmeal, it's cooked nicely. The blueberries are cooked also. And nice almonds on the top. I think that's gonna be a nice breakfast. You can see the chia seeds expanded and absorbed some of the liquid. There's another nice healthy breakfast. Try that using your Instant Pot or other pressure cooker. I think you'll enjoy this nice nutritious breakfast. Let's take a look at how that blended together in there. So we still have the layers. The nice uh, blueberries are still intact. And the oatmeal on the bottom is very creamy. Mix in those nuts. Wonderful way to start the day.